Now we're gonna show you how to cook the chicken right. Hi guys, this is Maria Diaz, and we're here at Prolifters Gym with Tom Pereira. And we are one week out. One week out. One week out for the show. We're gonna do back today, and um, he's gonna show how we're gonna do it one week out. Back attack. Start it up nice and light, just to get blood, the blood flowing. Them. Boss is warm. This is too light. All right, well, that's the point is all the workouts is going to be short, like nice and squeeze. You can't pound it with the weights anymore. So now it's just concentrated on squeeze. So here's, here's the famous question nobody likes to ask. How do you feel? Obviously depleted, she feels weak. And that's how you gotta go battle through it. So, as a competitor, you don't like to actually think about what you feel. You have to go through it. So, it's not a question that a competitor likes. Okay. Well, remember how Japa liked it? Almost oh, smashed his window. <laughs> he almost broke the, the window of his car. Hey, Japa, how you feel? Ah, almost broke his window. I think I went to Florida and then came back really quick. It calls Florida from Riviera. <laughs> I mean, it's my real tan. It's just inside of a bed. Squeeze it into his sneeze. I keep waiting on my side. CJ I never got a roll with ice. No rush, go on, you dumb. Push and show me you dumb. Peace and love, send to peace and gloves. Now you got a deal run up. Almost there. I think I have like probably six more pounds to go. Five more pounds. No, let's not forget, Maria always threw herself on the top of the show. We never ran away from, sh from top shows, ever. First show was Pittsburgh Pro, wasn't it, Maria? Your yeah. first show? Your second show was New York Pro, so we always threw yourself at the hardest. How got that be? She got that Now, Maria, look, when you put your, your hand, you pull them this way, not this way, this way. I think 99.9% .9 of uh, the people Because you're doing do this, you're still pulling with your arm. Yeah, even until now, I get, I, it's hard to do it. Rumor has it, rumor has it, I'm a savage, I'm a savage. Drop the classic, drop the classic. Thinking back, drop the classic, drop the classic. Drop the classic. Too established, too established. That the magic, that the magic, it's all the magic. Yeah. One more. Bye-bye. Last one. Whoa. Whoa. She always say one more, but she ended up doing one extra after that. It's all about you pushing yourself. If you know you can do one more, why not? So the whole trick on that exercise is literally in the palm of your hand. Oh, well, let's not forget, bodybuilding is an art, so... The person is on, like, painter, designer. So I actually wanted to go to school for interior designer because designing because I love art and I ended up doing bodybuilding and nutrition had to get it out the mud you know how it goes now we sitting at the top had to bring the bros never thought I'd be the one who would play the role now look at what we add man who would have known temperature rise and I feel the pressure is on me luckily I've been out here building an army camouflage on a rod we run this party you know now I'm excited to see my suit and uh, see how, because we made some changes we saw the first time and uh, we needed to make more changes. So we did that. And now just like the final touch is. Move it down, kid. Let's go. Oh, one more, that's it. Bye-bye. Now, beautiful. 
Woo! Got one yeah. extra there. Oh, that hurt. Felt that in my lats. You can see the energy level is dropped a little bit, but we're gonna go through with it. For all the people prepping, uh, you know, you always have to keep pushing from one more to the one more. And yeah, and thank God for one more day of prepping, right? Because you never know the next day. That's so. right. That's how champions are made. So we're here at our kitchen, and uh, Tom is going to show us how his, he makes our, I mean, my chicken, not your chicken, my chicken. Uh, yes, so as you guys know, uh, I don't cook my chicken because I suck at it. And um, yeah, he's been cooking my chicken for how long already? Uh, I'll say a few weeks. A few weeks, and it's been working pretty good. No more burnt chicken, none of that crap. So now we're going to show you how to cook the chicken ready. So now we're just gonna cut the fat out of the chicken. I don't agree with none of that crap in there. Um, if it was me, I'll be cooking it with everything. <laughs> yeah, Maria wouldn't care how burnt it is or how fat it is. I'm gonna show you my potatoes, what happened today. I mean, what's been happening. So here we go. So as we decided, we're gonna make slice thinner, not too thick. We like this whole pan because it cooks very well. Yeah, yeah it's, it's clean, but it's a little beat up. I know it doesn't look like it's clean, but I washed it. So uh, that will last us for a day and a half, depending on how like how my prep goes. Yeah, so it depends how close you get to the prep, the more chicken I eat. And um, obviously off season, I vary a lot. I do steak, I do eggs, I do uh, chicken, obviously. Fish, I'm not too fond of fish. And then the dogs eat almost the same thing as we yeah. I do. We cook for the dogs too, so we got like, what's that? Now we're doing That's more why ground meat, right? is, Yeah, now we're doing like ground beef, right, for them. Uh, but the big ones, they eat raw, and the little ones, we cook for them. And the veggies too, we yeah. cook, we put veggies in the mix for the dogs. So I get rid of some of this. Don't touch brush. it, no, no, don't touch it, I'll, I'll do it. Yeah, but don't do it, you, you have your dirty hand. Maria will be washing that later. No. Uh, we're not doing anything too. <laughs> you know how this works. I cook, she washes. We do usually do teamwork, but these days I don't feel like today. I don't feel like doing anything. How do you feel about this spices? To be you? honest, I really never care about spices. Just add, mix everything together. You don't like the taste of it? I love all of them. I don't care. Just mix them up. You can, you know. I can smell all the spice right now. Yeah. Smell good, right? Tom is like, oh, you don't get tired of the spice? I'm like, no. Is that enough? More. More. There you go. There we go. Potatoes. Burnt potatoes. Well, uh, one week out. Yeah. I suck cooking. <laughs> I'm gonna take this over to the stove. Are you gonna add something else, Tom? No, I, I, I think that's enough. What spice about the thing. green? The, this one. Let's add it. Yeah, why not? Huh? That has a lot of pepper yeah. in there. That's why I don't like it. <laughs> Let's add this Which one, one too. That one? I don't know. So here it is. I'm gonna put a high heat on this thing. And here's the secret: the cover. And that will that will do it. Make the chicken watery. And then with the flavors all absorbed in the chicken, and then Maria's gonna have a good time. Each bite bursting flavor. That's right, burst with flavors, Maria. <laughs> so yeah. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> so this is the final result. I mean, it looks, looks dry like. there, but it's not dry at all. It's not. It's pretty juicy. So yes. So that's one tip for the chicken, for the chicken lovers, and for people that are prepping and you don't get bored. A lot of, I have a lot of clients, I mean, not the, the prepping ones, but like the normal clients that wanna lose weight uh, and transform their bodies. Uh, so they complain about like, oh, what else can I eat? I already have chicken, I'm, I'm tired of eating the same thing. It's about how you make stuff. You can make it in the oven, air fryer, 
pan so you have to kind of like use your imagination for you not to get tired for me i can eat the same thing every single day of my life i don't mind uh, but there's people that are very picky but the same people that if you tell them okay go eat pizza every single day obviously they're not gonna get tired but they get tired of the the healthy food but um and to, yeah. be, to be honest with you it doesn't take that long no it probably will take like the whole preparation yeah. probably by with the final final chicken probably will take like 20 minutes yeah so just for the people in the united states everybody's very busy everybody has a uh, uh we are rushing all the time so whoever says i don't have time you have to make time especially if you want to have a healthy lifestyle and also if you want to keep up with the rhythm of this stressful life because at the end of the day if you don't eat healthy you don't you know feed yourself in a good way you're not going to be able to keep up with work and or school or whatever you're doing um so that's uh one thing that i i kind of like tell people all the time it's not about actually obviously the result of being healthy is looking good too but it's also you know taking care of your health your mental health and uh food has a lot to do with this so keep eating right uh or try to eat right and uh we're gonna give a few tips here and there you know and um, how we cook stuff and how we're very simple to cook. Uh, I'm not the type of person that knows how to cook. I know how to bake, but not cook. Tom is the one that knows how to cook, right? I, I don't mind it. That's it's why a, we it, match. It's a, it's a teamwork, so yeah. that's how it works. Yeah. Um, you know what I mean? I prep the chicken. Um, the rice is so much easier just for the water. Put it, yeah, water. And the potatoes, and the just cut the potatoes and then, yeah. But Tom helps me a lot while, you know, with a, before, you know, probably a week, two weeks out for a show. Your energy is not there 100%. One day you, you can do everything, the next day you can't even get up. So, yeah, it is what it is. When you say well, help a can. lot, I mean almost 90% of everything. <laughs> I do the other 90, Tom. So we're always 50 50, but now, like when I'm prepping, like today you did everything. Like almost everything. No, I did it yesterday. <laughs> but yeah, okay. All right, so I'll see you guys. I hope you guys enjoy. Um, the the workout and I hope you guys enjoyed our cooking lesson.